first ten come back so today we are going to discuss the sample paper okay so it is going to be visible on your screen so i am zooming it so first is first paragraph of reading is about nature so you can read it here i am uh, laying more stress on comprehension today okay because for comprehension it will be a problem for you okay because assertion reasoning and of different types are there and maybe you will you will be confused in more than one type of option so let us see here so first is nature is our mother our first teacher the greatest lesson that she teaches us is to maintain the equilibrium in life we learn to maintain composure through our joys sorrows and fears in fact there are a thousand lessons that nature can teach us provided we look for them so in the very first paragraph what it is given so always see the first two lines of the paragraph okay which is called as the topic sentence so here the main motive or the main message of the or the main theme of the paragraph is what is given right see here nature is our mother our first teacher now afterwards see the greatest lesson what it is it is supporting this first line by giving examples coming up to sir second para with time a sapling grows into a full grown tree something so tiny and delicate develops into a strong tree capable of supporting others so this is the supporting nature of supporting nature one minute and no matter how tall it grows how much it may flourish or how many animals birds it may support its roots are firmly buried from where it once rose that's a lesson to keep ourselves grounded respect and embrace our roots and give something back to those humble beginnings that nurtured us into who we are so here is supporting nature that how should we should be supporting to others and further it is you can say exemplifying only and the last line always also consider the last line of the passage also where it delivers the message of the that paragraph okay next one then there is the message one minute please then there is the message of peaceful coexistence i am because we are nature provides every creature a chance to exist however the existence of one creature of or being it depends on the existence of the other so this paragraph what it shows it shows the interdependence of the creatures on one another the tiger eats the antelope without the antelope the tiger wouldn't survive likewise without tigers the over abundance of antelope antelopes would cause them to starve to death so this is given an example what the main thing what the writer wants to deliver here is the, that interdependence of beings interdependence of creatures of one creature upon the other next i wonder i wonder if you have noticed that when birds or squirrels see a predator they give out an alarm call to their fellow creatures of the lurking lurking means hiding danger they did themselves in danger to save the lives of others many animals like the salmon usually die after this spawn but this doesn't spawn, stop them one life extinguished for the betterment of others is a small price to pay so it means that the individuals they are saving others right so the next one is the snow melts in the warmth of spring to give birth to fresh green leaves in autumn these leaves age into shades of gold only to be buried in the gold grave of winter changes in inevitable means unavoidable the sooner we embrace this the better it is for us so here the another aspect of nature is delivered here delivered is that that we should accept the changes in life change is a law of nature nothing is permanent in our life and this is again exemplified here if you cut a hole in the tree it will grow around it yes this is also reality and no matter what may come in its way a river will continue to flow similarly no matter what grief may break your heart nature teaches us that life life goes on right so here again what the what this 
lesson or what this person is teaching us that life is an ongoing process. We cannot stop nature because if we stop, life doesn't stop. Next, the last one is see the next image. So here it is, the last paragraph. Keep in mind that life isn't about making lists and trying to be one step ahead of others. This is not life. This is the main ultimate lesson which is delivered here. That life doesn't mean to wait for others and to be ahead of others. Okay, and not to make lists. Life is to live. Take a break. Stop being a workaholic and smell the roses. Do whatever makes you feel happy and most of all spend some time with nature to pick up invaluable lessons. It means nature is a great teacher as well as teacher. From nature we should learn different lessons. So this is the complete passage that we have read. Now coming up to the questions. Now you people can answer me. So here it is. According to the author, what from the following is the greatest lesson being taught? See, what lesson is taught by nature? I have read the complete paragraph. So the first one is balance in our emotions, posture to joys in life, afraid of unhappiness. See, it is afraid of unhappiness or indifferent to fear. What it is for? Ma'am, Ma first question is our emotions. Absolutely right. It is balance and not emotions. Next one is select the option. See the second question. Select the option that suitably completes the dialogue with reference to paragraph. See here, not direct one is given. It is only given in the form of a dialogue. Just see it. What it is there? Yeah. I have done well for myself in the school. I am the best they have. I can get admission anywhere. This is my moment. Sid said, congratulations. Just remember we should. So what lesson he would give him? What we should? Become strong despite our weaknesses. Be kind and supportive towards everyone. Respect the origins from where we have grown and nurture ourselves well from the beginning. What will be the right option? Second option. To be kind and supportive. Ma'am, third option. Third option is the right. Very good. Okay, third is the right, not the second. Respect the origins from where we have grown. In this context, in context to the dialogue, this is the right one. So, this is one I'm giving you. Next one. Choose the option that conveys the message in I am because we are. What it means. It means that tigers are dependent on antelope. Antelopes are dependent on tigers. You remember this example I have read in the passage? Okay, tigers are eating antelope. And if, if antelope would be absent, tiger won't be getting his food. And if antelope, if tiger would be absent, then there will be enormous number of antelope. So here, tigers are dependent on antelope. Antelopes are dependent on tigers. Or humans are dependent on animals, or everyone is dependent on each other. Everyone, everyone is dependent on each other. Everyone is dependent on each other. And afterwards, I told them, Determination to protect themselves. Uh, to protect? No. Ma'am, third option. Third option, yes. Yes, ma'am. C option. Okay, it is selfless. Uh, it is selfless. Uh, Assistance to help others. 
So see, because the last paragraph of this, I'm not going to show that even because it is the last one. It is mentioned one life extinguished for the betterment of others is a small price to pay. It is selfless assistance. Next, select the option with the underlined words that can safely replace lurking. Lurking, I have told you what it means. What it means? What it means? Lurking means hiding. So what is what? Which is the uh, you can say right option here? See here, it is given. The policeman pulls up the person who was wandering aimlessly through the city. It signifies see where lurking is fitting. The thief knew that remaining hidden was the best strategy to avoid being caught. Or the policeman was caught on camera while the while pouncing with force to grab the fleeing culprit. Or the thief was walking boldly into the house, thinking it was devoid of residents. Ma'am, B option. B. One second. B option. B B. B is also rather wrong. B. Remaining hidden. No. It is pouncing with force. See the next part to grab the fleeing culprit. It means he must be lurking, hiding somewhere to catch hold of the culprit. C option is the right one. Huh? Hiding. Right? So. Ma'am, the second option is the way that the thief knew that. Second option is not. See, second option, the thief knew that remaining hidden was the best strategy to avoid being caught. No. This is contradicting. Remaining, remaining hidden. Advice in paragraph six. What he advised? He 
indulging in competition with others making priority list taking life seriously having free time for others taking life seriously i will read paragraph for you because see here keep in mind life is and i will not change the screen you can see it here keep in mind life is and about making the so third option is keep going and trying to be i'm taking life seriously having three times after seeing the paragraph is clearly take a break of being the author Was shown to have a significant impact 
on the sales of the Daphne du Maurier thriller. The sales of the book in 2017, 2017 alone accounted for 23% of all sales since 1962. See here. It means that now they have given an example of a book upon which the film is made. The name of the film is also given. No need to remember what is there. Just yeah, get the idea. And main idea. Just get the main idea. And you have got to know that the sales of this book in 2017, it was alone a complete part of 23% of all the sales. Means this book was being sold since 1962. But when the film was made, It has a. It has. It is one of the most. This is one thing he wanted to do. Yes, yes, yes. They did. They write the book afterwards, and it accounted for twenty three percent of all the sales. Right? It means that you will comprehend what is not written in the paper. Next one. Does the source suggest that adapted films tend to perform better because films can leverage the popular popularity of well-known book to an existing audience? So now he is giving one of the reason that why these books, these films got popular because they have existing audience. Those people who read these books, when they see the film based upon the same book, they would like to watch it. Okay. So this is one reason leverage is value, increase value. Films adapted from books also tend to have a richer, more fully developed story to draw on. Now, what is another advantage they have told? That they have good story, good story to develop. Okay, they can get all the ideas from the book. In terms of TV adaptation, it was revealed that a quarter of dramas were based on literary sources and attracted 56% larger share of the audience than those based on original scripts. This is example that TV series or TV shows they will show, which are adapted from books. They are they are accumulating or they are attracting more number of audience. Now, 14 of the 35 high end series. In the period January and September 2017, were based on books, compared to seven based on true stories or historical events. Okay, it means that out of 35, seven were based on true stories or historical, and three existing films of TV stories. So, what is something more true stories as well as historical events? Now. In the case of 2016, BBC broadcast of the Night Manager research revealed that while the novel was in circulation for over 25 years, novel was in circulation. It means it existed for past 25 years. 62, sorry, 82 percent of the copies it sold were in 2016 and 17. Sales of the paperback edition remained strong in 2017, even after the series went off the air. Went off the air means when the series appeared, sales increased. But when the series stopped broadcasting, went off the air means stopped broadcasting. Then again, the sale was there. Now, last one in conclusion, the report states that. There is a strong two-way relationship between publishing and the wider creative economy, wherein a successful adaptation often has spillover effect. Spillover means uh, unrelated effects. Okay, there is a strong two-way relationship between publishing and wider creative economy. Films and books, or TV series and books, they have two-way relationship. Where in a successful adaptation often has spillover effects and gives a substantial boost to the sales of the original book. And after the series, the sales of the book also increased. Just understand the meaning, what the writer wants to deliver to you. Now see the passage. Now see the passage. First one is the purpose of the research by Publishers Association was to study what they study. First paragraph. Choose what is what the study. Variety in films and TV shows. Impact of films on books. Choice of books for filmmaking or connect between books and films. B option. B option. B option. Impact of films. Impact of films on books. 
Yes, what are you saying? Impact of films on books. Thank you. 